The solar project at Galen has been talked about for a number of years. And what ended up happening is we had kind of the, the right time, the right economics, and the right people that came together. For 2020, the goal had been to reduce USC's greenhouse gas footprint by 20%. So the, on a typical year, the solar system will produce about 915,000 kilowatt hours, which translates into 318 tons of carbon taken out of the air. The solar ray project is actually part of a bigger energy savings project that we've been um, working on for a couple years. So that includes LED lights in the arena as well as the practice courts. And then we're also looking at the, the back of house LED lights for the entire building and also looking at uh, a pony chiller for um, the heating and cooling of the, of the building. The pony chiller would significantly reduce the, the load required and allow us to just target those spaces that staff may be in when we don't have a game or an event or practices taking place. You know, I know we've done a lot of great work over the past seven years with zero waste at football games. I think we've won two out of the seven Pac-12 zero waste challenges. We did our first zero waste game this year in February and not expecting to achieve a 90% plus diversion rate and we actually achieved 91.6 percent diversion I, I believe and we diverted the the third most waste in the country for you know kind of the recycle mania program that they do across the the country for all the schools that choose to participate in that um, really cool here at USC we are like central to Los Angeles and we're going to be a central part of addressing climate change the Galen solar project is just really a, a visible statement to this community and to the city of USC's commitment. It is so great to be up here on top of Galen Center with this amazing project, and I'm excited to be with Mike. We got to partner with Athletics to do this. It's a real step forward, and it's something that was needed at this moment because it's a statement for the future, so doing it together was fantastic. No question about it, and when you see it firsthand, you begin to see what collaboration and partnership can pull together very, very quickly and uh, my hat's off to all the people involved in pulling this together on campus because we're all USC. Climate change is affecting us all and the only way we're going to deal with it is through a joint effort. To me it's all about teamwork no matter what it, what it is. I witnessed a lot of great teamwork through this, you know, the partnerships with procurement and, um, you know, FMS and CCD and, um, you know, I, our athletics colleagues, you know, everybody, right, and just making it that, that team effort. And coming through this and realizing that we really did it with a collaborative effort makes me feel that it's really true that we have a Trojan family and a Trojan team to get this done.